What's going on there, guys? Good morning. The Earth Master here on this November 10th, 2021 date, about 7, 907 a.m. California time. And uh, just doing a quick update video on an earthquake striking a short time ago on a 6.6 .6 earthquake near Japan. That's this earthquake right here, uh, just southeast of a Japan area. Got Taiwan well over here to the west, right around the Philippine Plate region, little subduction zone in this area. Seeing a pretty good size 6.6 .6 earthquake, uh, 10 kilometers below the surface for that earthquake. We have seen quite a bit of deep movement over here over the last few days uh, in the Philippine Plate area. Uh, let's see if we can bring this up. See quite a bit of movement here around the uh, Mariana Trench and northward. Uh, contributing to a lot of that uh, movement that we just seen this morning, the 6.6. .6. See some of that deep earthquake activity. I know we've seen quite a bit. There's, there was that one uh, just a couple days ago, um, down really way deep down there, 499 kilometers. Quite a, di quite a bit of deep movement and uh, very typical of a subduction zone uh, setup when it comes to uh, deep movement and ultimately creating uh, pressure along the uh, not only the lock sections, but further to the west here in this region, the dynamics of this uh, uh, plate area is uh, just very typical. I'm really surprised we haven't seen something a little bit larger. Uh, so still kind of watching this area for potentially a little bit further movement, a little bit uh, maybe maybe at least another 6.6 .6 or larger. Uh, you can see well over here to the west around the Taiwan region, uh, Japan sits up here. A lot of, lot of, uh, a lot of large earthquake activity over time. Let's see if I can show you guys the map here for this region. Quite a bit of deep movement there as well, inland, or I shouldn't say inland, but uh, further uh, down dip of this subduction zone. Uh, some large quakes taking place there as well. Where this 6.6 .6 struck, uh, looks like we've seen uh, oh a few of those over time since about 1900. See them scattered about, but still the potential for a little bit larger than the 7.0 earthquake exists for that region. The rest of the plates look uh, somewhat diminished right now, far as movement goes. Just some scattered earthquake activity around South America and the West Coast. We did see some uh, activity in Yellowstone region uh, prior to that 6.6 .6 in Japan. You can see on the map here, a little west thumb picking up a little bit of earthquake activity prior to that. And then the 6.6 .6 kicking up here on this map, that's signature from that distant earthquake. Uh, and sometimes that does show up uh, on uh, stations. But overall, folks, kind of looking uh, just like a could be a very active day. Let's check out the all magnitudes here. I am getting the live stream back up and running for some reason. Uh, computer wanted to do an update at four something in the morning. Uh, that is not okay with me. I thought I turned that off for some reason. Windows uh, 11 keeps getting uh, wants to update itself even with that update uh, turned off. So I'm a little little disappointed in the uh, in the uh, newer version of Windows. Oklahoma up here around Woodward getting some movement. Moreland uh, area 2.3 4.9 kilometers. Uh, some activity over here further to the east as well. Uh, but we will cover that a little bit more in detail, folks, this evening. But for now, have a great day. Live stream is coming up shortly. We'll chat you guys a little bit later. Peace out.